today's video is just going to be how to handle acne. This is quite a basic thing in hamster care, so I thought I'd make a video on it as I realised I actually hadn't, so I hope this helps you out. If you are a new hamster owner or you've got to exit a hamster or anything like an essential thing that you need to know the correct way when you own a hamster, so I thought I'd make a video. So we have a hamster here. One of the first ways you can pick them up, and one way that I would recommend doing when they're relatively new is the scooping method. So what you do here, get your hands either side and just scoop them up. So that is one way you just let them step onto your hand. This is something that should be done during the taming process and she doesn't want to. <laughs> so if they don't want to then you might want to try the scooping method. Oh, she might do it now. Nope. The next method you can do is picking them up like this. I'd say let them see your hand first because if they don't this can frighten them a bit. And then what you do is you just let them see your hand and then just pick them up like that. But don't squeeze, you have to be very light with this. And it's also quite a useful one if they are free roaming it and you suddenly need to get them. <coughs> Normally the instinct thing is to just go like that. But don't do it <coughs> like really quickly and don't just do it suddenly either because that can scare them. So now you know how to pick your hamster up, how do you actually just keep them there? So they will normally just sit on your hand and you can just hold them like this if you need them to stay still or you can let them go hand to hand like so or not. <laughs> Never pick a hamster up by their scruff or their tail. I mean, you can't really pick them up by that little tail there. Um, but Chinese hamsters, it is possible to, but don't do it. As this can injure them, it will scare them. It's just not good. And also, don't handle them like that and then grab onto them and then squeeze and lift them up on, like, vertically. As this can frighten them and especially if they are like new this might cause them to bite you so they can get away from your hands i'd only say ever turn them up vertically if you need to see if you need to give them a health check and you need to see their little area and also the only other time you should pick them up and like like that and hold them vertically is if you need to sex them so if she wants a summer flower seed Nope, she does not want one. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. I hope it helped you out and I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoyed all the little candy tuft cuteness. <laughs> so I'll see you all next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.